Thinking of buying or selling your home? Who's got the advantage in the market right now? KITV 4's Brenton Awa has real estate advice from the Hawaii Home Buyers Fair at the Convention Center. It's no secret sales of homes are up, so are the prices, making buying difficult for some. But despite what many may think, one expert says we're not just in a seller's market. It's really what we would call everybody's market. According to the Honolulu Board of Realtors, the average sales price of a single family home is 9.2% higher than a year ago. Sales have also increased by almost 25%. Both sound good for sellers. Many people have to come in with an, an offer above market value, above listing price, and many times it's an all cash winner who walks away with a deal. So what about those buyers? Even with stiff competition, experts say there's still two lanes of help, first time buyer loans and low interest rates. If you bought a $500,000 home in 1990 when the interest rates were 10%, you'd pay about $4,500 a month for your mortgage. Today at four and a quarter, you'd be paying about $2,500 or less. In other words, $2,000 less on mortgage. It's incredible. It's also affordable, but it might not last. Other experts say a home valued at $625,000 now could cost as much as a million dollars by 2017. The housing shortage in Hawaii doesn't help. What that really means is uh, unless more properties come on the market, then in like a couple of months, all the inventory on the island will be gone. So bottom line, experts say if you really want a certain property, expect to pay a little more. Brenton Owa, KITV4 News. If qualified first-time buyers can take advantage of several different loans, like the USDA loan, the VA loan, or Hula May, both the USDA and VA loans let buyers come to the table with no down payment.